Hi, my name is Jeff Rosa. I'm the founder of Promax Tool. I've got a couple of real cool things to show you this morning. So guys, stay tuned. We're working on a 2014 Mini Cooper, uh, having to change the catalytic converter. And you know, on a Mini, they have the exhaust manifold. It's actually a header system with the converter following it. Take a look real close. Now, to do this, I have to remove the engine mount and swivel the engine back to give me enough clearance to get the cat out. I also have to remove my O2 sensors here in the upper one. I've got a couple of cool tools I'm going to show you. Now, what I've done is removing this bolt wasn't a problem, but removing this one right here has been very, very difficult. I have sprayed it with uh, penetrating oil, and I've tried, of course, my impact gun. And as you can see, I've tried it several times, and it will not come through. So what I'm going to show you today is how we're going to use our new Kentucky Kicker, our half-inch drive, to show you how we're going to get that thing off. Remember, I'm putting some impact on it, trying to twist it, but I'm gonna show you how we're gonna use that Kentucky Kicker and the shock it technology to shock it at the same time I'll try to lose. Let me take you, let me show you what we got. I'm really excited to show you the 955 Air Hammer. It's a brand new, in fact, so brand new um, that we don't even have the badging on it yet. Uh, it's 3,000 blows per minute, super powerful, compact, but really like the 855, it, it, it's bi-directional. It does come with your, um, uh, your, your uh, automatic quick release does come with a spring that you can attach. Um, it's bi-directional, comes with your aluminum plug, so you can drop this in here like so. I'm going to drop this in here if I want to use it to pull things, or in this case today, I'm actually going to use it with a punch to use it with a Kentucky kicker set. I'm going to show you that in a minute. We're going to use this adapter, which is half inch, and drop it through here, and I am going to use my socket and my breaker bar to break this thing loose. Together, here's the 3 8 set with a 3 quarter set and one half inch set. It does come with a half inch punch, regardless of which ones you buy. Really, really nice set, real hot quality. And then lastly, to get my O2 sensors out, I've got the 940 uh, O2 sensor, 994, pardon me, 994 O2 sensor removal kit. I'm going to go ahead and take both the top one and the bottom one out. The bottom one, obviously, I can reach with this low profile, but the top one is recessed into the cat. Here you can see the new cat's recessed inside the heat shield, so I'll need a deep socket to do that, okay? So stay tuned, I'll be right back and we'll get it started. I wanna show you something really cool. This is the, the Air Tool Oiler from Steck. You may remember that uh, Milton acquired Steck, LTI and Promax Tool. Um, I wanna show you, this is really neat. What I love about this is it gives you easy loading of your air tools. Um, in this case, you can adjust it with this plastic uh, set nut. What this does, set screw, it allows you to adjust just the right amount of oil. As you can see, I've got it shooting one drop, so I know I can hit it twice if I want two drops in there. You can adjust as much as you want or a little bit as you want. It's really super. You can adjust it either way, 90 degrees like I have it, uh, 180 degrees. It's got a real nice heavy-duty plastic um, case with a uh, retainer, some pneumatic oil in it. It's really slick. It's really low price. You can check it out, and the best part about it is made in USA. So let's get started. What I've set up, gentlemen, is I have my impact socket, I have my Kentucky kicker half inch, I have my connector and my breaker bar, okay? I'm gonna go ahead and set that up, and now I'm gonna use my articulated punch, which uh, is in the kit. I'm gonna go ahead and shock it at the same time. I'm gonna put some tension on it and see if I can break that bolt loose, okay? So stay tuned. Nice. So you can see now that the vibration, the combination with the air hammer allowed me to break this thing loose. So now she's going in the right direction. There you have it. So that's the Kentucky Kicker, the new 955 air hammer. Now, what I love about this, as I said before, is 3,000 blows per minute, but what's really, really nice because it's got a great stroke, very powerful, you can stay on task, unlike a lot of other hammers that are far less in terms of blows per minute. So thanks for watching. If you have any questions, check it out on our website, promaxtool.com, ltitools.com, or miltonindustries.com. Thanks so much. Have a great day.